Alright, welcome to Pokemon Black. Oh, one second. About that, I had to show my door. Um, anyways, welcome to Pokemon Black. This is like my tenth time doing this, and so I fixed the problem. I use tape to keep up my camera so it doesn't fall. So. Without further ado, let's start naming my character. Now, it's gonna be my generic name. A lot of people... A lot of people cannot pronounce his name. Okay. Your name is Sala. It's Sala, not Sai Sala or Salai. A lot of people have said that a lot. So it's gonna be really tired of it. So your name is Sala, what a wonderful name. Well then, I'm gonna try to introduce you to two best friends. This is a feature I wish they brought back. Naming rivals. Well, they just name it for you. And I just like how there was two. I guess that's like paid, like repaying for what they had to do. Anyways, without further ado, let's get in to strain. No, that would suck. Alright. Game Freak presents Pokemon Black version. Now it's a little weird. Uh, well, I'm, I'm looking through what you see as. It's a little weird. Sorry about that. This is probably the best I've ever recorded. Now these episodes are going to probably be 10 minutes because of my app that just allows me only to merge videos for 10 minutes. I guess I'm going to have to cut a lot of times. So, wait a minute. Alright, am I late again? So, sorry. I don't know. I'm not gonna even try to say it. I know, I know, I've known for 10 years that you have no sense of time, but seriously. Today's day we get, get a Pokemon from Professor Juniper. I know, sorry. Sala, sorry, Sharon. I can. If someone could correct me or post a video response of what his name actually sounds like, I think it's Sharon or Charon, but I'm mostly sure it's Sharon. So, so where are the Pokemon? They were, they were delivered to Saul's house, so Saul gets first pick. Oh, hell yeah. Not really. The Pokemon are waiting for us inside the gift box. Okay, so you go first and take a peek at the box. I want you to meet the Pokemon right now. Alright. I have to say, these are the most lamest starters out of all of them. These are the most lame. Alright. I brought three Pokemon for you and one for each of your friends. Please sell your choices bullet and enjoy your Pokemon. Uh, yeah, guns are gonna come out and start killing each other. Alright, you got three to choose from. Tapig, fire type Pokemon. Snivy. Everyone loves this Pokemon. I do not. It evolves to a really weird Pokemon. I'm not going to spoil it, just in case you guys are falling along with Snippy. My personal favorite is Oshawott. When I first got this game, this is the game I, this is the Pokemon I choose, so we're going to go with September of Values. Okay, I'll take this Pokemon, Sharon. That one's yours. Hey, how come you pick out my Pokemon? Oh, never mind. I want Snape from the start, anyways. Yeah, the old. Now, you'll notice that the big change in here is that, um. You have two rivals. It's, um. Now, what's weird about this is that she, Miyaka, is the one that is gonna be the easiest rival to face. Trust me on this. You will have no trouble. That uh, first rival battle, I think they set their first move was either like tap, tackle, pound, or scratch, and they both all their, their second move is a defense lower move. I think Ashu Watts is tail lift. Yeah. Okay, now I go with stats. Defense. What well, I just lowered it was defense. How? It's how they can stand a physical attack. Something that actually hits them, like this. That's a physical attack. We'll get into special attacks and special defense a little later soon. Like, very soon. Oh man, I'm getting beat. So 
always a pattern here. I noticed they always use tail up when they're when they're about to kill you. You should have no problem beating her. But I've never lost to her. No. This is one of my favorite games. But personally I like Hark Old Soul Silver, so. No doubt. No. Uh okay, would you take a look around? Now, after this, you get, I have to show you something. I always thought this was hilarious. Alright. Now, what's so funny is that when you put cheats on here and you have, like, invincibility, he'll say, like, something like, Sal, your Pokemon didn't even take a hit. You must be really impressive, but your Pokemon need PP restored, too, so there we go. And he'll heal your Pokemon anyways, but I always thought that was kind of funny. And then Bianco says, Hey, sure, I want it's your battle, and I'm sure it's turned disaster to tell. Which, I have to say, is going to be fun. Sharon is going to be the hard one. I did not like Sharon. Because <laughs> every time, I never could win against him. Now, there is going to be one random Pokemon I'm going to use. I am not going to spoil what it is, but it's but Oshawa's probably not gonna be on our team for long, so just saying. Oh. Well, you did. Yeah, I knew defense learned this. No, I'm probably my die here. Yeah. Now, for base defense, your defense could be, or any stat for that matter, could be lowered six times. That's it. Or else it can't go any lower. That's it. So you don't have to worry about after six times, but you're almost dead if someone lowered your attack by six times. Defense. And attack is, hump, is your physical damage, like when you hit them. Alright. excited today all right okay this is what I always thought was funny it's a Wii console it's not even a scratch this whole room and there's paw prints on the wall but the Wii's not even a scratch Nintendo advertising right there folks all right now before we do move anything along I really need to do one thing Okay, your attack speed is always set to meet mid. Um, I always change that. Because for me, I hate, I hate slow text. I like them to go fast. Anyways. Hmm, should I end it? No, let's get down here and show the cutscene. I'm very sorry about all the trouble, ma'am. Well, um, we can clean now. Clean up, no worries, I'll take care of it later. Shouldn't you be on your way to meet Professor Juniper? Yes, thank you. Come on, let's go. Thank Professor Juniper. I'll be waiting in front of the Pokemon Research Lab. Oh wait, I got I've gotta go home first. Thanks for having us over. This is the weirdest mom of the whole entire game. Should remind me of my first Pokemon Bell. Back in the old days. Oh, and you know, after probably you need to rest your Pokemon. Yeah, that's probably a good idea. Pokemon, if you're going, uh, don't forget your cross transceiver. Now, when I when I first got it, I always pronounced it as X transceiver, and I totally realized it was cross. So, yeah. <laughs> Alright, I think that's enough for this episode. I'm sorry this was so boring. These episodes will get more interesting. And once after the first badge, you will meet my, you probably will meet my new companion. Anyways, this is Malfront Man, signing out.